Hello, in this video I want to talk about buying, installing and activating a StudioPress theme. So, when you, when you buy a StudioPress theme you need a StudioPress theme and the Genesis framework. So I've gone to the StudioPress site and this is the th Shop for Themes page. I've chosen the Lifestyle Pro theme, that's the one I want to use. So I click the Details and Pricing button, click the Buy Now button. And it, it tells you here you're going to get the theme and the Genesis framework. If you've already got the Genesis framework, you just need to buy the theme. But if, you've, if you don't have the Genesis framework, you'll need the Genesis framework and the StudioPress theme that you've chosen. Once you've bought the theme, you can log into the StudioPress site and you'll find the themes that you've already bought. Now I've got 63 themes, but you'll probably just have one if that, you know, if you've just bought one theme. Now when you log in, there's two buttons, there's a theme setup which gives you instructions and the download button. And if you've got a lot of themes, you'll see something like this. Anyway, I want I bought the Lifestyle Pro, so I click the blue download button and that downloads it onto my desk. Well, it downloads it onto my computer. I've dragged it onto my desktop. Now, to log into WordPress, what you've got to do is suppose your website's called myshop.com. You just add a forward slash WP hyphen admin to your domain name. So, if you myshop.com, add this to the end of your domain name. So, this one is it's a funny domain name, this because it's just a demonstrator site. But if you add that in here on the end of your URL and click there, press the enter button to take you to that page, it will um, let you log in. So where are we now? Logged into WordPress and I've got on my desktop I've got the both of the zip files for the Genesis framework and the Lifestyle Pro theme that I'm going to use. So if you can't see the dashboard when you first arrive at, um, at your WordPress site, this is the theme that comes standard with WordPress called 2014. Looks a bit like the WordPress dashboard actually. Um, but if you hover over this little house and click dashboard, you'll probably see the dashboard as soon as you log in. But if you, if you don't, that's what you have to do. Now, in the dashboard, you just go down here to appearance, themes. And we want to add a new theme. So click add new. Now technically, the Genesis framework is actually a theme, so it, it calls it a theme here. So we upload a theme. And what we're going to do first is upload the Genesis framework. So browse to find it. It's on my desktop Genesis there. Open and install now. So this is installing the Genesis framework. You don't unzip it. it um, WordPress will unzip it for you, so you don't unzip it. Now we don't want to activate the Genesis framework. So we return to themes page. And I'm going to add now the Lifestyle Pro theme. So we've installed the framework and now we're going to install the actual theme. Upload theme. Browse to find it. Here it is on my desktop. Open. Install now. Now this time we do want to activate it because this is the Lifestyle Pro theme that I'm going to use. So we activate the theme. You activate the theme, you don't activate Genesis Framework. Right, so now we've installed Genesis Framework, we've installed a theme, and we've activated the theme we want to use. So if we click this button now, click Visit Site, and this is the theme, see how, how different it is. And that's how easy it is to change the look of your WordPress website. Now, there's nothing in this site yet. I've got no posts, no pages, no images no nav bar, but we're going to do that in some of the next videos. Well, that's more or less all you need to know. So I'll leave you with the, um, the oh, I want to log out. When you finish, hover over this and click log out there. So always remember to log out. It always is. It's, it's always good to log out when you're finished. Anyway, I'll leave you with the StudioPress website. I do hope you enjoy the Genesis Framework and StudioPress. I think they're really good. See you in the next video. Bye for now.